Do you guys believe in air conditioning? No, you what we did this, this ain't our facility. Oh. Yeah, you stopped here. Yeah, this ain't our facility. No, how do you, you don't? Do you, you train? You train in? How do you train in? Like when you train, you don't be no AC or none of that. Do it? Not really. No, you just be like fuck it. When I was really young, I used to train. As I get older, I train smarter and not harder. Okay. You know, I'm not gonna go fucking 18 rounds. All that shit. I, I was ill. So I'm not gonna do that. Shit. Mike, how do you think? Like, 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 like with me, I had a little box game when I was in jail, and I'm thinking, I was telling him, I'm thinking about getting back in the fight game on 42. What you think? My chances are. Chances are none. Your chances are not good if you don't dedicate everything you have. Oh, so Mike, you telling me I got a shot to get in the ring? Yeah. Now I know, I know. Uh, Boots, I know Boots, and it's from Philly. And I told him I've been talking shit to him like, "Yeah, I spar you, whatever." You think I should do that? Listen, no. he's he know he, he's a mature enough fighter to know just how far to go with you, not to hurt you. He's not an idiot, you know. Yeah, I think you should go in there with him, and he should show you some other ropes. Yeah. What about do you, what about Cool Boy Steph? How much Steph weigh? One twenty two. He weigh one twenty two. I weigh one. Well, you should let, know what I used to do when I was fighting. I used to let the small guys just throw punches at me if I can. Get out the way. So I might have a chance for Steph, did he say? If I get in the ring with him, I might have a chance to win the sparring match. You might. No, you just get in shape. All right. But no, he, he keep definitely not in shape. He keep telling me, no, I, I get in that ring and do my thing. Listen, you know what I saw right now? Um, once before, I saw the baddest street. Everybody scared of this. He in the ring with a little simple pull him his legs are going all crazy. Uh, <laughs> he would take these motherfuckers off. It's a whole different game, um, a tough guy, this is not a tough guy sport. A tough guy's going to be real hurt in this sport. This is right. a thinking man sport. Right. This, this, when you're at this type of level of the game, only the smartest win. Let me ask you a question. Who is your your top five favorite fighters of all time? Not including you. Wow, well, it's, it's Duran's in there. Ali's on top. Sonny Liston's in there. Salvador Sanchez. It's too many. Electric Sugar Ray Robinson. Robinson definitely. I was going to go listen. I go all the way down to you. Joe Gans. Oh, man. George Dixon. That's These are the first black champions ever. Mm -hmm. In the 1880s, 1902, 03. Joe Gans Damn. was a master. They called him the old master. I was reading a book about him in the longest fight ever because the longest fight ever under. The Marcus of Queensbury for a championship with Joe Gans and Battle Nelson. They went 42 rounds. Damn. And so oh. after the fight was over, everybody discussed. And then at the chapter, I talked. Joe Gans was telling them um, he sent a letter to the bellhop to send to somebody. But he, the people didn't know who he sent it to. But in the letter, it said, it said the dog quit in the 42nd. He meant like 42nd rounds weren't shit. He said the dog quit in 42nd rounds. You imagine the guy saying that? 42 rounds. How the he, f he, he, This dog quit in the 42nd. He couldn't go the full distance. These guys are going to finish fights to the end. 45 rounds, 60 rounds. To whoever falls down, that's when it's over. The longest fight in history under the Marcus of Queensbury, the way I used to fight, was 110 rounds. And the reason why it was a draw, because they all their bones were broken. They had to bump each other. So they called it a draw. They couldn't pick their hands up anymore. 110 damn. rounds. God damn. Damn, how the fuck you do that? Determination and will. Your body. Dude, that's a different type of will. Yeah. <laughs> like, no, that, listen, what's the longest rounds you ever sparred, like in the gym? 12. What was that? 12 rounds. Damn, man. The Ali and them used to fight 15 rounds. Listen, this is the whole thing with Ali. Don't be thinking what you're going to do to Ali. I'm... Make sure, be, be prepared to go 15 rounds because you're going 15 rounds with him. Right. Ali beats a lot of guys just out of exhaustion. Right. You know, just, just no. Before he, all of his other shit he got to put on you, remember you're going 15 rounds. This ain't going to be no quick fight. Right. I don't care who you are. It's not going to be the overnight fight. Right. 15 rounds. That's some, that's some, do you think you could have fought 15 round fights? Absolutely. Yeah. I fought the last 15 round fights and History, but it didn't go 15 rounds. Yeah, 115 seconds. Probably, yeah. <laughs> probably, yeah. 